Creating a solid vocal chain can be super confusing. So here's a quick hit list of some of my favorite plugins and how I use them in the chain. Chances are you aren't working with a professional singer or the singer needs a little bit of help with the tuning. A lot of people like Auto-Tune, that's cool. I like Celimony's Melodyne. It can be kind of invisible, which I like. If you're looking to tune your vocals, get it. Number two is EQ. Uh, I use FabFilters Pro Q3. It's dynamic, it's super visual, I love the interface, but you can use something like Ableton's EQ8. It does the exact same thing. Use it to cut the low end and kind of boost the, the best sounding part of your voice that you like. Number three is a compressor. Now, a compressor will help you balance out the frequencies to make the whole vocal sound a little bit more even. You don't wanna overdo it. It can make the sound weird or too flat, but compression is absolutely critical. Hey, if you like this video, check out the link below. Better, my next song drops on 420, everyone's favorite day. I'm super excited about the song and I want you to go on this journey with me. Check me out on Spotify and follow me on social. Back to the video. Next is a de -esser. There's a lot of great free ones out there. I use Waves Pro R DSer. Uh, Fab Filter makes a really good one that I like, Pro DS as well. Number five is a delay. I use Valhalla's delay. Uh, Supermassive is cool too. There's tons actually built into Ableton. Sometimes you want something more creative or psychedelic or analog, and there's a delay for all of that. Play with your settings. Number six is reverb. You can think of reverb as like the space where your vocal lives. I use Ableton's built-in hybrid reverb, which they recently upgraded. Absolutely rad plugin. Sometimes you want your vocal to sound like it's in a really tiny room or a booth, and other times you might want it to be in a cathedral. Next is saturation. So when you add saturation, you can make a vocal sound a little bit warmer. Ableton has a built-in saturator. Definitely start there. Number nine is vocal align. So this one took me a long time to discover. Vocal lines save you so much time. So if you're stacking vocals like you should be, like you have a center, a left, a right, one in the middle, like, you know, some people stack 16 vocals. Using vocal line will save you hours and hours and days and days and weeks and weeks of time. Definitely get it.